my channel and welcome to November. So this means we're gonna transition from all of the fall Halloween vibes that we had for our daily videos throughout October, which was wild, amazing. You guys are seriously incredible. This family grew like tremendously in October and there's still new people coming in. So if you're a new subscriber, Thank you, welcome. I hope that you guys are having a great time. And so what I did last month was basically just like a bunch of all the things that I love. A bunch of travel, I did some vlogs, I did some beauty videos, I did some get, readies with, get ready with me's, I did some fashion stuff, a lot of home decor, things that you guys really have been asking to see. And one thing that I started doing last year was sharing DIY projects that I love, like painting and creating mouse ears and Disney DIYs and holiday DIYs. And I thought that I would kind of merge that today because I love watching these videos. I find them almost therapeutic. So if this is something that you guys are into, please let me know in the comments down below or give this a thumbs up so that I know that you guys like this type of thing. But just watching how I make things and like putting it on a time lapse. I feel can be very therapeutic to watch. I never thought to do it myself because I didn't know if you guys would be bored by it or even if I was that good at making stuff, but I have a couple of projects in the works that I've been recording and filming, so I figured I would share them. So for today, what I was gonna do was share exactly how I made these beauties that, wait for it, you ain't ready. Like dead, I can't. So I made these myself and I'm pretty proud of myself. They light up. The little battery pack is hidden back here. So this is what the back of them look like. There's a little Mickey candy on them. I've got a big fluffy bow on it. So I'm gonna take you guys through exactly like the time lapse of me making it, but really quickly, I'll show you what you need. So I got most of the stuff off of Amazon. I'll link it all down below. I got like a little rinky dink garland. You can actually either clip off the branches or just use one big branch. And I'll show you guys exactly what I did for that. These are like the little branches that <laughs> fell off from it and I basically just tied it all together that way. The lights, they come in a pack of six. So I have five left here obviously, so I will show you what one looks like. So it just comes in a little box, Amazon again, and you've got your little battery pack. This is how small it is. And when you turn it on, you've got your lights that you can wrap around the ears. And then in terms of the candy, you can either buy pre-made little scrapbook stickers. So these are by Jolie's Boutique. I used to use these types of stickers all the time when I was doing scrapbooking. So these are an idea. I didn't use them. The other thing that you could do is I had these ornament hooks that basically look like candy canes. So you could bend these, make them into little candy canes. I'll show you what I did though. I got some polymer, polymer? How do you say that? Clay? Clay off of Amazon. So I used some red and white and I would roll it into some sparkle dust and basically create little candies. I did a couple big, big spheres and then some little spheres and I made little Mickey candies with them, some candy canes, not that hard to do. And then I got some red felt tip for you when you're doing your ears and you have sequin fabric, always get the same color felt behind it, just it'll make the color pop that much more. So felt and a red sequin table runner from, again, you guessed it, Amazon. So this is what it looks like if you don't have the felt behind it. So whenever you add the felt, kind of adds that layer of, of street cred. See what I mean? Quality. So that's how I did it. Um, I will take you guys through that right now and give you guys a little bit of a behind the scenes of how I created it. So if that's something you guys wanna see, then just keep watching. was the night before Christmas I was closing down for business In my little prison shop When the bell on the door Jingled once more And then time almost came to a stop but somehow I knew, and maybe so did you, that everything would change from now on. Yes, from this Christmas on, from this Christmas on. Christmas 
We are headed to Disney World tomorrow and we are going to Mickey's very Merry Christmas party. I'm so excited. I literally feel like I'm going to cry. I'm so excited. If there are any must do's that you like absolutely adore at Christmas time at Disney World, please comment down below. I will do my best to document all of the things. I know that I'm going to cry. I am a Christmas freak already. It's snowing outside. It's like the first snowfall of the year here and we're flying out to Florida tomorrow. This is going to be amazing and I'm definitely going to wear these and take all the pictures and share them on Instagram. So if you aren't following along on Instagram and all over the interwebs, it's Angie Belmar everywhere. If you are not subscribed, go do that and hit that bell so you don't miss any notifications heading into all of the holiday videos. And as I mentioned earlier, give this video a thumbs up if this is something that you guys like to see because I have way more DIYs that I can share with you guys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye dudes.